What's good, what's good? Scorpio, thank you for clicking on your video. Um, this is, I'm gonna do a, just a quick little spread for you guys. Um, um, I'm using Oracle of the Unicorns. And I'm gonna do, I'm gonna grab one Oracle of the Mermaids just for like an overall look. So I've shuffled, I'm gonna split the decks. Pasts, we have compassion. Present, we have hope. Wow. Future, we have expansion. Well, wow. interesting. For over all experiments. Um, compassion, be gentle with yourself. Forgiveness will set you free. See the light in yourself and others. So I feel like you've gone, you've gone through something hard. You've gone through something very hard that, that could be, um, that could have taken a massive toll on, on, on your compassion for being, you know, for others. Um, and then we, in the current energy, we have hope. Um, it's a really cool card. But this, to me, stay positive. The worst is behind you. Look up, yeah, look up to the light. Okay, wow. And then future, we have expansion. Look at the light. There's the light. You're coming through the light there. Spread your wings and soar. Share your message and shine your light. Show the world what you're made of. So I feel like you've gone through something really, really hard. Um, and it's, it's taken, it's taken a quite a big toll on you and you're coming into this, um, this positive energy, you know, hope. And I feel like you, you, you've got to stay positive about the future. Otherwise, otherwise good things won't come in straight up, straight up expansion, spread your wings and soar, share your message and shine your light. <laughs> Look up to the light, shine your light, show the world what you're made of. Okay. This to me is, is you coming into your own, okay? I feel like this, you've got to have this love for yourself and this hope about, about your expansion and where you want to go. Um, overall, we have 33, manipulation. From the Oracle of the Mermaids, manipulation of nature, forcing change, cruelty, and the pursuit of knowledge and arrogance. So I feel like there was a person, personal people in your life that were, not really good for you, very toxic. Um, and I feel like you've got to have this compassion to let them go and walk away from that situation, guys. Okay? Hope and expansion. All right, let's get into the meanings of them. So for compassion, we have... Compassion, compassion, be gentle with yourself. Okay. Forgiveness will set you free. See the light in yourself and others. You are an old soul who is joining through many lifetimes and had many experiences. You learn more each time you incarnate and each life you always do your best. Okay. It is easy to look around, compare yourself with others and feel that you're not good enough or not as far ahead as you could be. Your life is not a race or a competition, Scorpio. Okay. It is a personal soul journey for you to take at your own pace and in your own way. So please be gentle with yourself. See yourself through the eyes of the divine as perfect. Worthy being, and know that you are loved unconditionally, no matter what you have ever said or done. Set yourself free from the prison of guilt, shame, and unworthiness you have locked yourself into by forgiving yourself. Wow, that's amazing. Be conscious of the critical voice in your head and replace its judgments with thoughts of love. The compassion will lift you into your higher energies, lighter emotions, and greater capacity to receive. The same is true for others in your life. Be willing to release all of the resentment you carry. You know that you that you only poison yourself by holding on to blame yes yeah wow yeah you do okay be conscious of the critical voice in your head and replace it with the judgments and thoughts of love okay the compassion will lift you into your higher energies, lighter emotions, and greater capacity to receive. The same is true for others in your life. Be willing to release all of the resentment you carry and know that you only poison yourself by holding on to the blame. Look for the light in everyone and know they are doing their best too. Let waves of divine compassion flow out from your heart 
to the world around you. Miracles happen when you live from the place of love and when you see the good in everyone and everything. And that's, that's, that's legit. That's manifestation too. It's when you see, when you can, when you can see the good in things, nothing's really ever bad. Nothing. Like nothing. Okay. Hope. Hope. This card's, this card's really cool. It's like, um, it's like a really realistic one. So hope. Stay positive, the worst is behind you, Scorpio, <laughs> yeah. Okay, look up to the light. You have been through a challenging period, but now the darkness is lifting and a new day is dawning. Fill your heart with hope for the worst is now behind you and this turning point brings new possibilities for peace, happiness and prosperity. If you have felt broken, you will return to wholeness. If your life has been chaos, order will soon be restored. If you've been in scarcity, abundance will begin to flow. If you have felt loss, you will find your way. This unicorn brings the reassurance of new beginnings and the blessings that are to come. He asks you to focus purely on the outcome you want. Don't look back, only ahead to, the new, to your new direction. Turn your face to the light and take one step at a time, knowing that with each stride, your life will be easier. Be patient on your journey and know the unicorns are by your side every step of the way. <sighs> Crazy. Okay, I'm, I'm really liking these cards. I'm really liking these cards. Expansion. Expansion, expansion, expansion. Um, and this is, this is, this is so Scorpio's, so Scorpio's cards. It's like, you guys are so hard on yourselves that it's, you should, I know a lot of Scorpios that find it really hard to grow, um, to change, to change, change their habits, change their patterns, transformation. That is, that is the biggest uh, goal in, in a Scorpio's life is, is transformation. Okay. So I feel like, I feel like with this love and compassion for yourself and staying positive and hope and fear and, and moving in the direction that you want, you, you will get what you deserve, Scorpio which is which is absolutely the best okay you deserve nothing but the best and don't let anyone ever tell you otherwise okay expansion 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 very pretty card spread your wings and soar share your message and share your shine your light show the world what you're made of you are brilliant, talented, and now is your time to soar into success. Yeah, wow, after all this, yeah, look at that. Coming out of the dark, letting go of resentment, fear, anger, all of that past shit. Let go of all of it. Fucking let go of it. You don't need to hold on to it, okay? Expansion. You are brilliant, talented, and it is now your time to soar into your success, Scorpio. Your soul is calling you to share your message. Shine your light and make a difference. Have the courage to do things you are scared of. Stretch out of your comfort zone and into your potential. Although you may feel some discomfort at first, you will soon feel like the Pegasus. Yeah, flying out of the clouds and into a brighter skies. Do not allow anyone or anything to clip your wings. Keep you grounded or make you feel less than you really are. Others may feel uncomfortable as you expand. They are just anxious you will leave them behind. Instead of shrinking yourself to, a, to appease their fears. Stay true to your path and continue soaring higher and shining brighter. By doing this, you will show them how to do the same. It is up to them to have the courage to follow. You came here for greatness and it is now time to show the world your magic. Wow, Scorpio. And that's literally, that's transformation. I feel like that's a transformation coming out of this dark, coming out of this dark and, and, and soaring, like fucking soaring. So for the oracles, experiments, we have 33. So looking into GM food, so looking into food, cosmetics, products and food sources developed within genetic manipulation and experimentation. All experiments are not bad, but many are cruel. When humans use other creatures for their own selfish purposes, own selfish purposes, we see it all the time. 
They lose the very part of themselves that is most beautiful and noble. Many claim ignorance or have been persuaded that experimenting on animals is necessary for human health and well-being. Fuck off. You are now awakening and seeing the connections between all life forms. You are awakening to the wrongness of seeking to understand something that by taking it apart and most often without consent, separating families, tribes, colonies of, of creatures for purpose that are selfish and cruel. This took place in Atlantis. The mermaids witnessed this. The creatures of the Lemuria, Lemuria, and the animals who were often torn apart on tables as if they were unable to feel. We need to step in, all of us, and change it. This is happening again. That's why we're talking to you now. And I feel like that that's a message with what's going on around the world. You know, like, are we not test subjects of the government at the moment? Are we not? Um... I feel like this is just, just this is just a time of, of of holding that hope, holding that hope and being compassionate, you know, and it'll 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 keep us on our path, on our true path, true north. All right, Scorpio, I fucking love you guys so much. Um, I hope this helps. Please just leave a comment, comment, and let me know what you're going through. I I, I want to know what my fucking fams is is dealing with, and and. If I can help in any way, I will, okay? So, till next time, stay real, stay humble, stay blessed, 1133, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.